What's up everybody? This is Aaron and I normally don't do unboxing videos, but in this case I have a really rare new speaker. So I thought I would take the opportunity to create an unboxing video. Uh, not a lot to say here. I'm just going to open the box up, check out how it comes when it shifts. So this is the Perlison S4B is a bookshelf version. Uh, Perlison is a newer company. Supposed to be some top tier stuff. Uh, haven't had a chance to test it yet, obviously, because I'm just now taking it out of the packaging. And I will go ahead and say that I apologize in advance for the audio. I know it's not great, but my neighbor across the street is cutting some trees. So I'm trying to do this inside the garage to avoid that and the wind noise because it's crazy windy. Not great lighting, not great audio. Uh, I'm not going to drag everything out to set up for it. So with that said, here is grill. Let's see, take the gander at this. Grill. So that's one of the pieces. Right. Let's take a look at what the grill looks like. It's actually pretty heavy. You can see, I'm assuming those are magnets right there. And the cool thing about this is that it's rubber on the back. You can actually tell I'm pushing in on this. That's pretty neat. So I will set this over to the side. Well, I'll do that later. Okay, okay. All right, so now we got the box. Roll this over. Take this off here. Some side pieces side pieces that's kind of funny if you think about it uh, another grill this could probably go on the tweeter or the wolfer area i'm assuming they're probably interchangeable but i don't know so let's take it apart and see if it looks any different to the naked eye at least and it does not it looks the same to me at least right now uh da, da, da. Let's set this over here this out of the way now you may be wondering where i got the speaker from uh an owner i did contact per listen months back maybe around march or so uh, they just said that none were available for review um so i said okay i contact them again got the same reply uh, then a viewer said i've got a pair i'll loan them to you and i said all right these are about $7,000 retail or $7,500 retail. And notice that they come with little white gloves. So I am going to put those on because this is all gloss and I don't want to get fingerprints all over it. Like I said, these are not mine. So I will take care of them the best I possibly can. I remind myself of another YouTuber at this very moment. Y'all may know who I'm talking about. <laughs> shout out to FOMO white gloves like you FOMO I'm trying to be you if he's watching this he will say hey don't cramp my style dude and I will say my bad homie let me spin this around because nobody just wants to look at the back well you can't see that right there there we go Let me go ahead and say while I'm at this. All right, these gloves, this is a slick surface. If you're handling a speaker like this, and I would especially think the larger, heavier one, because this is almost, I think, almost 30 pounds. Uh, this is just maybe a note to the manufacturer. If you can, provide some gloves that have like rubber padding that grips better. Because when you go to pick the speaker up with these white gloves, it'd be super easy to drop these speakers. Super, super easy. Now, how do I know that? Because I've already taken one of these speakers out just to kind of get an idea of what I was going to be going into to help make this process go a little bit smoother when I'm shooting the video. Da -da -da. Get it over the back here. See what I'm saying? It just kind of wants to slide out of your hand. You know I mean, to me, that screams danger. And I'm not going to set it there. I'm actually going to look at this. Must have came out in shipping. 
set this down right there. This looks like a link for the output. So that begs a question, where is the other one that I just set it down? Is it trapped inside of there? It probably is. Let that sit there for a second. Give me my fingers back. Yep, there it is. All right. Uh, as far as I know, these speakers are brand new. They haven't even been taken out of the box. Actually, these speakers are brand new. They have not been taken out of the box. And I do know that because I broke the per listen tab a minute ago. You saw me do it. And uh, voila. So there we have the per listen S4B. It is now unboxed. And I will go set it up for photos shortly. But yeah. That's it. Cool.